So first of all is to go to the team's uh, website. So you go and light uh, and go to the team's website and TSA service, uh, self-service portal. So you wait for it to open. And then, uh, so here we have the post, your ID number. Um, you have your ID number there. Uh, so then you go because now you have forgotten your password. You come to forgot password. So you go to forgot password. You put your ID number. Let me put my ID. Sorry about that. So you can put your ID number. Okay, in this case, I already have an ID number, so that so I've been so you put your ID number there, and then you make sure if you are a Kenyan citizen, make sure here it indicates. So this indicates if you have uh, you are Kenyan citizen, you have a company because we also have uh, teams registration for companies, so you can register as a company, financial institution, you are Dira, an agent, a circle, an alien. An alien is someone who has stays in kenya but is not a kenyan so they have an or something called alien id alien id is just like a foreign certificate which they use uh, like a kenyan id for foreigners you are driving school your diplomatic mission or diplomatic officer so in this case we are kenyan citizens so you submit so you can do this um for financial institution for every other uh, form of registration you have so here you have uh so you will choose please choose the authentication method so you will use phone number in this case as your authentication method so we have a phone number we show you the correct phone number that you use when registering your team's account and then you get verification okay so teams will send a verification message to your phone And that is the message uh, which you put uh, into the fill in the verification information which has been sent to your message on the number that you use to register. So I'll put my verification code here. Okay. So after submitting now, so and remember, guys. If someone asks for a reset of your, if for a message that has been sent to your phone, uh, so that they can log in into your system, never ever give anyone information to reset your team's account without your consent, because this is the way um, fraud fraud people do uh, to get access into your team's account, which is a security breach and dangerous to to your account. So always uh, make sure. You, you who has consent to change your password and never allow someone to send a message because immediately they get this code that's it they can change password and then it's uh, risky to your account although you cannot log in into a team's account without a security code but it's still not safe so we will go in we have step one step we have finished step one we have step two which is uh, now changing our password so you'll put your new password okay so you put your new password so put my new password there I'll put my new password again. All right. So you have your new password there. Confirm. You confirm your new password, and then we continue to step four, which will tell you that you have successfully reset your password. Uh, click here to sign in into your profile. So when you go to sign in now, 
can be able to sign in with your new uh, password you put your id number with the logging method so if you are an, an alien id diplomatic id a username or a certificate of incorporation for companies you still use the same method so you'll go to use your username or stroke id number and then you use your new password and they will get a code the code will be sent to your phone as a security code and then you'll be able to sign in so i think that's pretty much it and uh, remember to subscribe to this channel for future tutorials and you always come back uh, click the notification button and uh, for future uh, tutorials about uh, e-citizen and kra services thank you so much